Fuckers. It's Thursday. We're doing Thursday uh, Make Stuff Day with Nate. Or we're just catch Nate. What do we call it? It was like... It's like Make Stuff with Nate. Is that it? Make Stuff Thursday? I don't think I had anything to do. I don't think the name had Thursday in it. Maybe. I don't know. But it's Make Stuff with Nate, I guess. I don't know. I gotta come up with a catchy name. Like Two Minute Tuesday. My Instagram show. That's, you know, that's a nice, catchy, cool name. Make Stuff with Nate is kind of, eh. When there's two A's in it, it's kind of got alliteration, but not really. Hey, Eddie. How you doing? I started a new sketchbook. Look, Ghost O's. It's backwards for you, but pretty cool. In the back, it's got this little monkey on a car. You're not home yet. Oh, okay, well, better, better get home. <laughs> Thanks, Eddie. You look like Hernan Gomez from the Raptors. I'll have to look that up. Hernan Gomez. Hernan, Hernan Gomez. Oh yeah, sort of. Yeah, I can see that. Her okay, well I looked I looked at images and it didn't go to him. But anyway. Hey, Mish. <laughs> yeah, Hernan Gomez, I guess. Yeah, sort of. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I see it. You booked your little guy tattoo? Nice. I mean, no, no, bad. You're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to get little guys a tattoo? Come on now. Come on. You guys see Mish in the, in the comments? That's so cool. We had our, our art show. Was that? That had to be more than a week ago now. That was not last week. It feels like it was last week. That was not last week. There's no way. No, that was two weeks ago. Okay. Time. It really do be doing that thing where it goes forward. Okay, Eddie. Thanks for thanks for being here. God, I mean, I've been oof, back to back. So much stuff. Yeah, it was an art show. I had so many orders. And I freaking finally finished those. And then I keep getting more. Which I'm not, like, complaining. I'm just, like... Ugh. And then I'm finally, I'm finally starting to like get a, uh, a handle on everything, which is great. Uh, and then so now this week I'm actually back to drawing instead of my just working uh, that I was doing last week, like cutting stickers. And now I'm just, I'm just drawing stuff. And <laughs> I invite Guzzi to go live together. Yes, Guzzi. What's up? Hey, did you, did you want to go live, Guzzi, or you just did that just? ask if you wanted to because uh maybe we can start the show um but yeah no i'm drawing again this week ghost o's my new sketchbook ghost book 48 two more and i'm at 50 that's crazy and then i'm gonna have to like i don't know maybe i'll have to make some uh some sort of uh okay okay goosey all right so many stickers, yeah, no, crazy amount of stickers. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by the comments. Um, I have two more ghost book until 50, and then I don't know, like, I, do you guys think I should do like a compilation thing? Ben was asking for, obviously Ben, you know, Ben wants everything printed, which is <laughs> fucking awesome. Um, but yeah, I, I, geez, I gotta do something for it. Like some sort, maybe, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, maybe I could do like a Kickstarter to like get the first 50, 50, <laughs> first 50 printed uh, and like formatted. I could like pay an editor to like help me format and um, hmm. yeah, I could put like notes in there and stuff. That could be pretty cool. The highest tier will be yours, yeah, <laughs> nice. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be a Ben tier and it's just like, I don't know. You get like a gold, like every page is made of 20 karat gold. Something like that. Um, oh yeah, we got a couple more minutes before we start. Uh, yeah, I don't know, it'd be cool. It'd be cool to do like a thing. Like the first few ghost books though were not great, honestly. There's like, there's some, uh, oh, I gotta close my door. There's some like questionable, I but also it would be interesting, I guess, to see, like for people to see the stuff I started with. Like I started, the, the first ghost book was actually like the second ghost book I did, kind of. I just, does, I wasn't naming it anything at the time. I was just, uh, yeah, I was just drawing these like weird things that don't even look like ghosts. I think I've shown them on, on live before, but like, 
I don't know. I don't know. I guess I would include that. And then like every, it would be cool to do like a chapter thing where it's like, uh, um, I don't know, each go like each ghost book, you just have everything and then like it's like chapter one, ghost book is zero point five, and then it just cuts through. It goes all the way to fifty. And you could just like that'd be cool. I don't I can't I don't think I could like partner with a publisher or something for that though. Anyway. Um whatever. It's time. It's time to draw some stuff. What do you guys want to see? Let me know in the comments. Uh kinda of talk about artistic process. I could, yeah. No, that should be pretty cool. I'd love to do that, but I, I can't justify it. <laughs> hey, Leo. Goop. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I gotta, I, gotta, I gotta think about that. Look, hey, no. Little guy will not be a part. I, he, he will be omitted from every page that he would be on. Uh, need something weird and goopy. Nice. Yeah, I gotta draw that. Hey, hey, Goozy, get the little guy out of there. Get the, get the little guy out of the comments. A decrepit old man living in the woods. Okay, all right, frogs, nice. Yeah, okay, okay, I think I got an idea. Uh, sweet, I was about to turn off the light, no. Um, how do we do this? Man, they, they switched around how I, oh, there we go. Flip camera, that's it. Nice. There you go, now it's forward. Beautiful. Little guy will be omitted from all pages, all inclusion of the ghost book. Uh, let's see, okay. All right, we're drawing something. I wanna try maybe more of a scene thing. So like we got a decrepit old man, um, maybe something with frogs and goop. Something like this. Something like this. Okay, guys, hypothetical. You, the creek? Oh, yeah, Goose, yeah. You're expecting the creek, right? Uh, I got a new... I uh, My my old um, thing broke. And so I had to buy a new one. Like, it just wasn't the light... The, the wire to the light was all fricked up so i had to buy a new one and this one doesn't creak like the last one did so um yeah my iconic creak is gone which is actually kind of too bad because it was a pretty like i think it was a pretty important part of um my tiktok live reviews because i'd be like i was on tiktok live the other day and this is all the stuff i drew and then it, you know, I would like pull on the light and it would creak and it was very, very attention grabbing. Um, but now, now it doesn't do that anymore. Yeah, I, yeah, I miss the creek. I miss the creek for sure. Decrepit old man, here he is. Nice. <laughs> okay, here we go. Um, so old man, he's going to be visiting his goop. He's got a pile of goop in his backyard. And every day he goes out to, to look at it just to make sure that it's still goopy. Now, this may be Leo when he grows up, since he's such a fan of Goop. Um, I think that's up to Leo to decide if, that was, if that's what he'd like his future to be. And there's a little... Hey, wait, hold on. Got a little froggy legs. Nice. A 
Oh yeah, that's cool. Yeah, there's little froggies inside of the goop. <laughs> See, they're like just chilling in there. Can't wait to get old. Yeah, you get to ch check on your goop every day. It's nice to have you back here, uh, Leo. I remember you were one of the first people to watch a lot of my videos and comment on it, and you were always so. It was always so fun to see your your request for more and more goop, or your pointing out of all the goop I was drawing, and it made me realize how much goop I truly draw. Waiter, there are frogs in my goop. Yeah. Actually, speaking of which, there's a special drink my girlfriend makes. It's aloe water and like literally any alcohol, but usually vodka. Uh. And we call it goop. Because it's got chunks in it. Let's see. Is there anything else I can add to this? No, that's pretty good. That's cool. Okay. It's supposed to be. Why is... Hello? There we go, nice, okay, oof. You almost lost me there. Need some goop juice now. <laughs> Make it, it's, I mean, if you like aloe water, it's great. Um, and if you find aloe water disgusting, then don't try it. But it's, yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, now we're charging, good, good to see, okay. Um, next page, baby, let's get some suggestions. That's French for suggestions, if you um, aren't bilingual such as I am. Let's see, yeah, I'm gonna draw a little kitty in a sweater. That'll be pretty cute. Um, yeah. His coop? No, 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 it's goop. A ladybug with way too many books to read. That's pretty funny. This this ladybug's got way too many books. That's like the beginning to a 90s movie. And this librarian doesn't have enough books. What are they going to do this summer? Lady Bug in Love. There we go. We got a little paws coming out. And he's in a sweater. Sweater, sweater, sweater. Nice. Sweaters are always so just like nothing. You know, they just do like anything. And then people wear it. <laughs> your f your brain's fully full. Nice. There you go. The iconic kitty tail. Perfect. There you go. Get that as a tattoo. Nice. He's really excited to like, it's for Christmas or something. Are you Goozy's bike? Okay, hold on. It's the Poopy's bike. It's not just for Goozy. This is my, actually one of my favorite things to draw. This is like the only thing I will agree is a doodle, you know? Cause it's just, it's just so simple and like, kind of goofy the first one again so i can screenshot again goop to <laughs> you get the goop with the frogs tattooed there you go there's the whole thing and there it is just the goop just a little bit of goop right there you are a special goozy you are an integral part of my live um lore
Okay, let's see. We got a ladybug with just too many books. Draw an adorable Greek god. Adorable Greek god. That's, um... Yeah, I could probably pull that off. I would draw a ladybug. Give it a little, like, spinny antennae. Antennae. That's a blush, if you can't tell. Wait, Leo, are you legitimately getting the goop tattooed? Because that's, <laughs> that's pretty funny. That's awesome. Let's see. You got a hand here. Ladybug in love this summer. Nice. Licensed white boy. Thank you. Did you wait? Did you send something? You just oh, nice rose. Thank you. Just need to find someone first. Yeah, I gotta get one of those tattoo artists to tattoo it on you. I I never have the patience to look for a tattoo artist. I only had like a couple people. Um. This summer, lady in love. Yeah, I've only I've only I had a couple people tattoo me, and then I did the rest of them because I just like didn't want to pay someone i guess and it is cheaper overall to to have your own stuff if you want to tattoo yourself a lot um this just looks like like a mustache for sleep stories your voice is so sweet oh thank you katrina i appreciate that i keep uh hearing i thought my voice was annoying but i, I keep hearing people say that uh, they like my voice which is really nice to hear Uh, let's see. We got a book here. We got this pile of more books. I'm just gonna sketch out these books. Just look at these books. They're just freaking. You're oh man, you guys are so nice. Book loving lady. <laughs> Your voice isn't annoying. No, 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 no. Oh, thank you, Goosey. Thank you, everyone. You're so you're so kind. Top tier voice. Wow. I mean, lucky me then that I, I have to talk so much and you guys enjoy it. It's really cool. Especially like my chill voice, I guess, when I'm I'm just relaxing like this, you know, just drawing stuff and hanging out. That's, um, that's cool. That's good to know. All right. I think that's enough books for this ladybug. Let me give him some spots. And I say him. I guess... I don't, I don't know. I mean, he's got a mustache, so. Frigate. He's just, he's just got a mustache now. There you go. And he's got a dark belly. Cute. All ladybugs? I mean, they can be male. I don't think they're all male. Unless there's like a boy... Like a boy bug, and that's all the female ones. Oh, I'll go to uh, have a good sleep, Leo. Thanks for being here. Let's draw an extra goopy little ceiling goop for Leo. Nice. It's a little goopy. That's some ceiling goop. <laughs> You're doodling along? Nice. You hear about the stuff with dress from? I was just about to say. I was actually like, should I say it or like like is it worth bringing up on live but yeah no that's that's fucking i mean I, i'm i just keep hearing stuff and uh and by keep hearing stuff i mean i heard the first thing and then it was like also oh, it was children and i was like mm. i'm really hoping it's just like someone trying to fuck with him like ruin his career but i feel like 
that could just be he's just a, a bad guy. You need a pick of the sweater cat? There you go. Yeah, that no, that's brutal, man. It's like especially he's so talented and so funny. Um I mean I would I mean oof. Yeah, it's just it's brutal. Especially because like I don't know, man. I don't know. It's just it's it sucks. That's real bad. That's bad behavior. Um <laughs> uh, I was gonna say should I draw something from that? No. How about this? You guys suggest something else for me to draw. In the meantime, actually, I'm gonna draw a cool fox. Foxy man. Something about these um these cool anime glasses. Look at this. Hold on, he's got like Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah, the Greek god, that's right, the cute Greek god, okay. Draw a really fat gelatinous man wearing a tutu, okay, deal. Although, considering my past, I'll likely forget that, but let's, let's see. Once I'm done this fox. The Greek god is a great idea. That would be it would be really cute. I gotta look up like my favorite Greek god or something. That's cool. Got like buttons. Chibi Hades. That's cool, yeah. What a cool fox. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's do. I want to see Hades. Oh, it's just going to bring up the game. God damn it. <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess Hades is just like the devil depicted here as being a Greek man with long hair. Okay. Um, Greek Hades. Still just a man with a big beard. I'm just, I'm going to give him Kawaii Satan. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's, yeah, that's what I'm going to do for sure. go like this uh. there we go like that nice I'm not going to do it the Greek way because it's just a person. They're all kind of just people. So, I, yeah, I'm going to do it the... I'm going to do it this way where he's got the, like, the furry hooves. Or not, the furry legs in the... The, the furry legs and the hooves. Sorry, my mind is <laughs> elsewhere right now. Um, Here we go, yeah. He's like a half goat man. There we go, like that, nice. And 
nice, and his arms like that, and then, great. There, baby Satan. Her furry. <laughs> there you go, Guzzi. That's your god. That's the that's the that's the thing you praise. Furry, furry Satan. Um, oh my goodness, I'm sleepy. Oh my god, it's only been 18 minutes. Jeez, <laughs> baby Satan is cut. He is a cutie patootie. Okay, new page, babies. You know what time it is. We gotta throw some um emojis in the chat. I, you know what, not this funky. Fa hey, you know what, you're right. Okay, you know what, guys, I'm gonna take you on an adventure to get more tea. Because there's not a lot of you here, and I'm thirsty. I need to energize, babies. Here we go. It's an adventure to the kitchen. Baby, listen. You know it's time to get some tea. Baby, I'm on a mission. I gotta get some tea in my booty. Everybody loves drinking Sorry, one second. Um, I can't put you anywhere, so hold on. I'm gonna look at this bowl and these scissors right here. See, scissors. Okay. Um, oh, okay, well, hold on. Okay, here's a cute bowl that Taylor made from for me. She uses it, but. That's the bowl she uses. It's grapes. Because I make cereal that has grapes and bananas. And, um... Oh, hey, Eddie. Grapes, bananas, and blueberries. Ooh, also. You guys gotta check this out. See this? See how it's red? It's red. Oh, but look at that. Ooh, now it's yellow. And now it's green. You can't really see the color in here, but it's changing. Discord mod, you're right. And then there, this one's purple. You also can't see that. Okay, I'm gonna take you back to my room so that we can hear the, uh, or we don't have to hear the tea thingy going, but um, once it's done, I'm gonna go get tea, okay? So you might have to remind me. Cause I gotta wake up, babies. You're missing the tour. No, don't worry. We'll we'll go back on the tour. And in fact, I will show you how gamer my fridge really, truly can be. With no hesitation, it will, it will be the most gamer fridge anyone has ever seen. <coughs> oh yeah, yeah. Gelatinous man, nice. Here we go. There we go. He's got like this really kind of goopy smile. His arm kind of and he's shoved into this tutu. It's just spilling out of it, kinda. Oh, this man, his gelatinousness knows no bounds. Okay, it's time for tea, babies. Okay, hold on. Wait, I'll finish this gelatinous man and then... His hands are just lost in the, in the fat of his arms. He's got like a couple fingers on that side. You're shit-talking me in the server? Hey, Guzzi. 
Gosh, I guess I gotta go check on it. I finally got into my Discord, like, way after last week. Because uh, the those of you who were here will remember I couldn't even get into my own Discord. Anyway, where, which one is it? Is it art? No, it's not going to be art. Uh, general chat. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on now. Oh, no. Hey, Guzzi was lying. Guzzi, Guzzi, uh, freaking lied to me. So those of <laughs> you can go, you can go, go see, you can go see that Guzzi is lying. Go check out my discord. It's in my, um, in my bio. You can see all the horrible things that Guzzi says about me in the general chat and everywhere. Honestly, there's like 17 different shit post channels and they're all full of nonsense and Guzzi is in charge of all of them because I don't understand how the internet works. Uh, okay, time for tea, babies. I'm going to take you back to the kitchen. Uh, okay, you ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Whoop! Okay, let's go back on an adventure. Okay, check this out. First, before the tea. Hey, hey, yo. Hey, yo. Uh, 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 gamer fridge, gamer fridge, gamer fridge, gamer fridge. Okay. Next, we get tea. Um, I can probably, yeah, I can set it up there. There you go. Okay. I'm gonna get tea. I gotta get honey for my tea. I get the spoon for my honey. This is special honey from a college that my cousin works at. They have a beekeeping thingy on the roof. And crazy thing is, they weren't supposed to have that beekeeping thing on the roof. Uh, they just snuck it in one day. They, they went up to the, the roof and installed the bees. And then they were like, hey, you can't do that. You're not supposed to have bees up there. We told you no. And they're like, all right, take it down. And then they didn't. And then... They, uh, you know, they ethically get the honey from the bees. I don't know how it works, but they do it. And they, they gave the first bit of honey to the people who said, don't do that. And they were like, oh, this is great. This is actually amazing. And they, I think they sell the honey too. So it was like, oh, it's like a money making thing. And uh, so they let them keep the bees. So that's the lesson for you, babies. Break rules, because no one cares. Okay, I was just here for tea, so that's it. Oh, you guys see my mug? It's an award. I won it. It's pretty cool. Okay, let's go back. Let's go back. Alright, we're back in action, baby. Eh, eh. I'm having so much trouble here. There we go, okay. You are locked in. Fantastic. Okay. Let's get some more suggestions, baby. That's a lot of bananas. Yeah, I, I love bananas. What can I say? <laughs> the mysterious... <laughs> you guys okay? Are you still here? Okay. Creature, is that a thing? Ooh, yeah, I want to draw bananas. I love bananas. You're getting them tatted. That's well, you already got a little guy to get tattooed. I don't. You don't need me to draw him. Draw a banana being unpeeled by a criminal. <laughs> okay, first I'm gonna draw a banana, just a regular banana, because freaking love drawing bananas. Um. I've always said, if you don't know what to draw, just draw bananas. Because everyone draws bananas different. Uh, or at least I think so. You know, I mean, everyone draws most things different. Unless you freaking copy everyone. But then that being said, everything is based on something else anyway. So, truly, there is no originality in the world. Um, but, yeah, draw bananas when you can't think of something. 
and then keep drawing bananas until you want to draw something else. And then you'll think of something. What is creature? Why? I, oh, it's you? Your creature? Oh, it's your thing. Okay. I don't know. I wasn't looking at your... <laughs> I can't see your thing. I don't know. I don't know what that, uh, what that is. Angel trying to be mean. A goat eating a sign. Can we draw buff frog deadlifting? Nice. Okay. Wee wee wee. That's a pretty good suggestion. First, I'm going to draw... First, I'm going to give this thing eyes because it's bothering me. Okay. First, I'm going to draw a criminal opening a banana because I think that's real fun. Then I'll do... Um... <laughs> ben said poo in the discord you guys should go check that out it's really funny uh what was i drawing oh yeah criminal criminal opening banana he's like he 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 i got the banana i got to open it and then the banana's like no please don't i want to see my wife and kids he goes, he, 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 you can't stop me. I'm going to eat you, banana. And then he does. And the world is cruel, but it continues onward. Nice. just creeps through life it's true let's see we got like oh, this is gonna be tough okay hold on It's a criminal. Got this. Nice. Thumb. Cool. There we go. Banan. And then there's the ending of it. Banan. That's pretty accurate to what a banana looks like. There we go, he's got his like little shading. Cause he's a criminal and he's got his criminal jumpsuit. Or not, he's like a sweater basically. Here we go. Nice. A rib cage with a bird inside. That's pretty cool. Oh, the movie Spirited Away. Yeah, I love that movie. It's a good one. And No Face was my fa favorite character as a kid. I'll draw No Face. That'll be real quick. We got this, and we got this. Um, it's like that and then this I think and I'll make them real short there you go no face cutie oh, yeah we drew the manager <laughs> by the way everyone who's watching feel free to join the discord it is in my bio and they're shit talking me in there right now uh, I don't know why my own discord would shit talk me but actually, never mind, because I totally know why they would do that. That's just what they do in my Discord. <laughs> um, let's see. Yeah, frog deadlifting. You got this frog with long arms. And then... 
he's like in his stance, you know, he's ready, he's lifting. Oh my goodness, look at that big foot. That's a big foot, okay. So this is not how deadlifting works as far as I'm aware, but here we go regardless. This is just how it's looking. Nice, and we've got another set of weights. There you go. And he's like, oh, uh, uh. he's sweating. He's sweating up a storm. Sorry guys, I probably uh, popped out for a second there. There we go. Hop. Yeah, he went. Hop. Draw salad fingers, classic. Yeah, that's basically just this guy. Hey, thanks for sharing the live, Savvy or Savvy, Savvy. <coughs> Excuse me, what? Got little fingers that look like they're made of cucumbers. Hubert Cumberdale. What are you doing here? He makes, like, um... There's this short he made called, um... Oh, what was it? Cream, I think. It was just called Cream. Yeah, David Firth. Yeah, he made this cartoon called Cream. And uh, it's very good. Uh, here, wait one second. I'm just looking up salad fingers. I'm just looking up what his face looks like because I've forgotten. Ah, nice. He's got little like dips there. This is this is how I'm drawing him, obviously. Um, Hairless cat with four eyes, that's pretty cool. Ooh, someone made a 3D rendering of salad fingers, it's pretty cool. Oh, I gave him too many fingers. He's only got three. I think there was actually a salad fingers finale, maybe, can't remember. There we go, salad fingers. Pterodactyl salad fingers. Well, it's the end of this page. So you know what time it is. Time for the new page, babies. Throw some, um, Eddie, uh, yeah, happy to see you when you come back. Um, throw some emojis in the chat. I want chairs. I want, um, pregnant dads. I want, uh, salad and some fingers. I want a poodle. I want, uh, one of those uh, earwigs. No, ear, um, eggplant. I want freaking peaches, you know? We got a spoon. Sp hey, Goozy, no winking. No little guy, definitely no winking little guy. We got a puzzle piece, okay. Okay. Goozy, get little guy out of the chat. That's not allowed. You know that's not allowed. He's banned from all chats. I can't believe you would do this. I cannot believe you. And by the way, everyone who keeps buying the little guy sticker pack, stop it. Stop it. I can't take it out of the shop. Please do not buy it. I have to fulfill it if it's bought, but I don't want to. It's very upsetting. You guys understand all the terrible things he's did that he's done. We can't we can't let him be supported by having stickers all over your laptops and your skateboards and what have you. It's, it's bad. He's a bad man. Okay. Thank you, Mish. Yeah, please don't buy. Feel free to buy any of the other stickers, but not, not the little guy stickers. 
understand me. Hear and understand me now. I'm going to draw a nice little B now, okay? Because that's what I feel like drawing. I feel like drawing a little B. A little bumblebee. He's so cute. He's got a little stripe going down the middle. He's not a, he's not a thief or a manipulator like little guy. He's just a cute little bumblebee. Um, yeah. Goosey's your best friend creature? That's cute. You know what? I, maybe he's just gonna have like a neck. Just a neck coming out. And I mean, okay, if he's got a neck, he should probably have like a shirt on or something. Like a, maybe like a, like a vest. Just like a cool little vest and like, oh, probably like a name tag or something. Um, and, okay, so the, this B is a Walmart employee from the 90s. Um, I don't know where that came from. I don't know why. I guess he's got, like, times are tough for bees, so he's, like, he used to had to get a job. An axolotl inside a tornado. I don't even remember axolotls. Here, they look kind of like this. Like that, right? He's got a neck too. And I mean, I guess he should also probably have a vest and, and like some arms. And you know what? He should probably have a name tag too. Okay, so these this axolotl and this bee are both employees at a Walmart in the '90s. I don't know why this happened. I don't understand. This is really strange. Um. Okay, let's try let's try a different drawing. I don't. Um. Okay. Let's. Uh, let's. I'll do like a. Let's draw like a little house. It's like a cute little house um, with like a chimney and it's got like a front door, maybe like a window, a uh, door handle, like a shadow under here, maybe some like tiles or what are they, what are they called? Roof, roof tiles. Let's, you know what? Let's give them a neck. Like a little neck, just the neck, you know. Well, okay. I mean, if he's got a neck, he should probably have like a shirt, or like maybe um, maybe like a vest, um, and some arms, I guess. If you know, if they got a vest, they got a, they probably would have arms. You know, let's give him an intake. Okay, so this house is a employee of of a Walmart in the nineties. Um. Hmm. Okay, that's that's um how about um okay. Yeah, scare scarecrow's a good idea. Okay. We'll do like a have like a little it'll be like a little bag, right? And you know, obviously it's always like pulled back or whatever. I guess they usually give them hats. I didn't I didn't do that, but they got these like drawn on eyes. Like a smile kind of um Maybe some like patchwork. Yeah. And, um, I don't know. Uh, oh, oh I mean, it's a scarecrow. That's always kind of funny if you give it like a, like a crow on top or something. Maybe that's a raven. I don't know. It's a black, it's a black bird of some kind. And you know, what? let's give it a neck. Just a little neck, yeah. And then, well, I mean, if it's got a neck, it's probably have a shirt, and um, you could have like a vest on or something, I guess. Um, and some arms. And you know, let's give it a name tag. Hold, wait, oh, hold on. This, okay. This, um, this scarecrow is a a Walmart employee from the '90s. That's, um, okay, this is, uh, this is weird. Okay. Um, uh, 
I really, um, okay. Let, I don't know. Let's draw like Winnie the Pooh or something. That can't, that can't go wrong. That, that'll, that's, there's a clear design there. Winnie the Pooh looks a very specific way. Doesn't have a name tag or, um, like a, or like a vest or anything. Um, like he loves honey, you know? And actually he's got, um, he's got that friend, right? Piglet. Um, he's got those like big floppy ears. And you know what? Let's, let's give them both next. Just next. Cause like, you know, they, I mean, they, they've had next. They, they definitely have next. Um, and I think if I remember correctly, they had vests like Piglet definitely. I think he had like a, like a stripey vest and then, um, and pig, uh, uh, sorry. Winnie the Pooh had, um, he had some sort of, he had like a, like a shirt and like, I think a vest on and, um, they both had name tags. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait a second. Wait, I can't, oh, Jesus Christ, I did, I, did, I did it again, I did it again, I can't believe it, what is happening here, why am I, why do I, this is, guys, I just drew a bunch of Walmart employees from the 90s, I'm really, um, I, I gotta start a new page, I don't know, let's, Let's do some emojis in the chat. I, I can't, um, I, um, I'm really, oof. Yeah, blame it on the disco fridge is right. I think it did some, geez, that's, guys, I, I really, uh, that's really confusing. I don't understand what happened there. Let's draw, you know what, let's draw a pregnant banana. It's expecting potassium look at that oh oh nice that's so cute look it's glowing Guys, wow. It's just so excited to be a new mother. Banana gender reveal party. <laughs> it's going to have a grape. <laughs> That's great. That's grape. Yeah, um, yeah, this is the father over here. Here you go. He's so excited to be a father. Actually, I don't like how I do that great one second. It'll be like, it's more like that. And then I can give him like little legs. Um. Oh God. Okay, hold on. I'm just, okay, don't look. That was a mistake. I, I was going to draw the hat and my fl it fl slipped. Oh, God. Okay. Don't. I'm going to. Um, oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, I'm just going to draw another banana. Maybe I can. Actually, maybe I can fix this. Maybe, um, okay. Well, hold on. I got a. Um, there we go. Yeah. That'll. Okay, and then, um, oh, oh no. Um, um, there we go. Yeah, and then like that, and then, um, oh, jeez. Okay, um, yeah, okay, and then. Uh, 
There you go. There we go. Yeah, there you go. That's the ticket. There, see? Fixed. I'm sorry for that inconvenience. Um, but I was just trying to draw Mickey Mouse as a Walmart employee from the 90s with a paper airplane. Uh, thanks for being here, Ben. Love you. Thanks for coming. This I don't know what baby you're talking about because this is definitely um this is this is just Mickey Mouse as a Walmart employee from the nineties. This is not um this isn't it's not any like another character or anything. Um <laughs> if you guys have jo- enjoyed this presentation by Sketch Nate, please feel free to join the Discord. That was fucking that was really corny, I'm sorry. But look a banana. Wow. Our love child. Yeah, we all collectively made this this character. I uh, refuse to acknowledge little guy in any fashion because he is such a horrible creature. Guys, what are you doing? You're going in my Discord shit talking to me. That's such a silly thing to do. Why would you do that? Why would you say say and do such horrible things? We got... Ooh, we got 10 minutes left, babies. Let's get a real... Yes, Quinn, thank you. Thank you. Um, what uh, should I draw next? No, I'm not drawing a nose. Uh, you know what, Guzzi? Here, fine. I'll draw a nose on the sun. I'll draw a nose on the sun right now. Look at that. Look how goofy he looks now. Look how stupid that looks. You understand? You see what you've done? Little guy is a menace and we cannot, we can't jokingly discuss him. We can't, we can't talk about him like it's a joke. It's not. It's very serious business. He is a master manipulator. He's murdered hundreds, if not thousands. And you just want me to draw him like it's silly. Like it's a goofy, silly time. Who does? This banana? A flower guy? Okay, cool. Nice. Flower. Flower guy, flower guy, flower guy, flower guy. It's a flower guy. It's a flower guy, flower guy, flower guy, flower guy, flower guy. It's a flower guy. It's a flower guy. I had a um I had a comic about a flower guy. It was like I think it was all made out of claymation or not claymation, it was just all made out of clay. It would have been claymation if it was moving. Um <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, I have not had any of my tea yet. Hold on. Um Um, it was weird. It was very alternative. I think it was probably made in the 90s. I forget where I was going with that, but just thought it'd be cool. Guys, if you've enjoyed this, this live, please follow, share the live tell all your friends eat a whole pineapple you told one friend that's so nice oh thanks for sharing the live kelsey or kelso sorry you draw a funky lobster been well but the swelling's gone down <laughs> how does how do creature join your discord uh it's in the top of my bio you gotta get ready for a job interview nice go sarah heck yeah banana phone oh i mean i gotta draw a banana phone and a king rat because i love rat kings even though i don't think they're real I've never seen anything but one photo, and I think it's not a real photo. It's just like a drawing or something. 
or like a an artist's rendition you might call it this is someone hating being inside of a pineapple Look at that. Wow. It's got like a cool bag and it's a flower. Jeez. Wow. So fashion. So cool. Okay. Um, banana phone. No, I'll do Rat King first. How much time do we got left? Ooh, like seven minutes. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> He's got the little little toesies, his big old tail. Nice. Great. It's a rat king. Get that as a tattoo. Thanks, Jasmine. Okay. Why is the banana pregnant? Because it had sex with this grape, obviously. Um. All right. Not my last drawing, but one of my last drawings. It's going to be banana phone. Actually, it might be my last drawing if I take a while to do it. Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. That's too many buttons. <laughs> Banana phones have extra buttons, so you can call, like, literally anyone in the world um, at, at any destination. Like, it'll make, it'll make non-existent phones. It'll make, like, a plastic phone ring. Like a phone for children, you know? Like a toy phone. Could have just said toy phone, I guess. And it's got an antenna. See? Natural. There you go. Thanks, Maddie. You need banana phone, yeah, or hamburger phone. Might actually get the rat that's a tattoo because I like your drawings and I have. Oh, nice. Well, there you go. Zooming in on it again so you can get a good shot of it. Feel free. All I ask is that you send me a photo on Instagram. Rat King Banana. How much time do we got? Oh, uh, we got, yeah, three minutes. Okay. We can pull that off. Man, I filled a lot of pages. Jeez. Okay. Let's see. Rat King Banana. Bonanza. A Rat King Banana. Man, I don't even know what that looks like. That's like... Like this, and then... Like, goes off into there. This way. There's like a whole knot of bananas, string things, whatever coming out of here. Little guy, hey, no, get the little guy out of here. Here we go. 
go. Yeah. Yeah. We got this like crazy knot of banana tops. Whatever you call those, if they have a name. There you go. The Banana Rat King. Stem. Right. Duh. Thank you. Thank you, Diggy. Appreciate you being way smarter than I am. Um, all right. We got time for one more drawing. Actually, before that, here, let's draw a little crown above the Banana Rat King. Okay, throw in your suggestions. We got one more. I'm not doing a little guy. Smartest guy in most rooms. <laughs> oh, you're back, Eddie. Wait, you're already here, huh? Thanks, creature. Uh, a speaker's guy. Guy with a speaker as a head. TV stomach guy. That's a Teletubby. I'm down for that. I'm going to draw, you know what? But instead of everyone calls my numps Teletubbies, so I'm just going to draw a nump with a TV stomach. But you keep suggesting stuff because I might still have time after I'm done this. I'll draw it real fast. Nice. Yeah, and like that. Very cool. He's just like, hey, 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 cat with a hat. There you go. Cat with a hat, baby. Cat with a hat. Cat with a hat, baby. Buff Queen Elizabeth. Uh, you're going to have to suggest that next week. Okay. Uh, let's. Oh, yeah. First, before I turn it back, let's review. Look at that. Banana Rat King. Nump, but it's a Teletubby. We got Pregnant Banana. A, a son with a nose. There's the banana's husband and a boot above the banana's um, belly. It's not related. This is um, Mickey Mouse as a, uh employee from Walmart in the 90s with a paper airplane flying beside it. Also a banana and a pineapple man who's very fashionable. We got uh, rat king we got a um like flower guy who is a an employee of uh, walmart in the 90s here's banana phone it goes ring 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 uh oh goosey there you go where is it where's the oh other page <laughs> there you go get that screen cap get it get it get it okay anyway these are a bunch of employees from Walmart in the 90s. Um, here we've got another banana, very thick lines. And we got a uh, amorphous fat man in a tutu. There's a dog. Here is a, a evil man. He's a thief or a, a, a bad person. He's opening a banana. This is, um, what's his face? Salad fingers, just being him. There's a frog lifting, very strong, no face, very cool, love that guy. Uh, we got a cat in a sweater talking about bikes. There's a goopy ceiling thing, a ladybug that's um, that's reading too many books, just got too many books to read. There's a real cool fox, that's a cool looking fox. If someone gets that tattooed, oof, oof, oof ba doof. I love that. Uh, and there is cute Satan. Next up, we got an um, old man uh, looking at his uh, pile of frogs in his goop that uh, is in the woods outside of his house. There you go. That's everything.
Ghost O's, Ghost Book 48, babies, working on it. Very excited. Looks so cool. This is my favorite cover I think I've ever done, maybe. It's very thematic. Um, okay. And back to me. What's up? Oh, bright. I need some tea. You love the cover? Thanks, Eddie. I'm glad you guys like it. Yeah. Maybe I'll... Oh, I wonder if I should make, like, the, the ghost book stickers available. I don't know. No, probably not. Maybe, I mean, for Patreon, maybe I should just give them out as like a thing every time a thing is done i'll just give out one of the i'll give out the cover as a thing i don't know i'll have to think about it i'm so my brain is wiped right now uh by the way if anyone's not in the discord already go check it out there is a lot going on <laughs> i i am just looking at it I've, i'm caught up there's a bunch of people who joined thank you for joining that's really cool to see you in there uh you guys can uh I mean, there's a lot of shitpost channels. Subway Surfers is a fan favorite for some reason. You guys love it in there. Um, and, of course, you'll always see screen caps of all the best drawings posted in there. There's also an art channel, so you guys can post your own stuff. Really cool stuff in there. I think that's where I spend the most time. I don't always comment, but very good art being posted in there. So, so sick. Um, yeah, I'm going to sit around for a bit if you guys have any questions or you want to talk about anything but other than that dunzo baby lovely night thank you goozy you're so sweet yeah i'm excited by this um this cover it's just it's like the most fucking solid one i think love to buy your shirts and other stuff but the customs would take my life yeah I, oh my god customs are crazy frog goblin thank you for the follow if I die, oh, uh, how long have you been sketching? Uh, bye, 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 bye. Um, how long have I been sketching? I've been drawing my whole life, basically. Um, like when I, one of my earliest memories is, well, my earliest memories being locked in a basement or locking myself in a basement. But one of my earliest memories is uh, uh, my dad teaching me how to draw people out of ovals. And I didn't like it or understand it. Um, but, uh, I mean, yeah, since then I, I've always like, I've always wanted to draw, but I didn't like the like strict part of like, you know, um, of having to make a base layer or any of that. That's why I freehand everything now, because like just the idea of like wasting my time drawing something, um, just to erase it and then draw something else over top of it. Yeah. Oh, you missed the whole cut. Oh, okay. All right, I can switch it. I, I, I've seen you in here, and I know uh, you guys like to see. Okay. We'll do one last review. First off, there's the new cover. Very cool, very slick, very nice. Um, yeah, we drew a man, an old man looking at his goop with a bunch of frogs in it. Uh, we got a cat in a sweater. We got goop. We got a ladybug with too many books. Baby Satan. Um, fox. A cool, very cool fox. Chubby man. Banana. No face. A criminal with a banana. Uh, a frog lifting a whole bunch of weight. We got um, salad fingers. I'm also going to make a review video later. So you guys will see all this stuff. Um, I should probably do that before I go to sleep. I always forget to do it, and then I, you know, I just don't post it. Uh, uh, but yeah, that, that's the ghost book. Okay. Um, I enjoy watching you freehand. It gives me more confidence when I enjoy it. That's cool. Nice. Uh, what book is, it's, uh, Pentelic. I love them. I have a bunch, I've already bought a bunch. Like I'm, I'm stocked up for the next, I think six books or something. Love them so much. And with like fine liners, it can be any fine liner. Uh, lately I've been using Micron and a lot of people say it looks like it's printed in the book, which is really cool. It doesn't like bleed at all. Uh, I mean it can if you like hold it, but even then like really no. Um, and yeah, the paper is beautiful, so smooth, so like just oof, amazing. There's no texture to it at all. It's just like just smooth. Very good. Um, you can get them from like independent stores. I usually get them um, from uh, there's like a 
I forget the company, but it's like a, a, a family owned art store that, that distributes them, which is pretty cool. I don't think you can get them from Pentelic directly. Um, do you like Sharpie pens for sketching? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, the, 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 um, the fine liners they have, and they don't even have fine liners. So it's just like thin tip markers. No. Um, I don't like them. No, at least not for this type of drawing. I can use it for just like whatever drawing, but not, not for this kind of thing. Uh, they, they bleed too much and they're just not, they're like, you know, they're like the, the catch all sort of company for, um, for stuff. Now like the thick markers, those are great for like, if I'm drawing on garbage, you know, um, like I have so many Sharpies in my pocket right now. Um, but I don't, I, I use that for like goofy stuff, not for like my sketchbook. Uh, no, I'm not American. I am from Canada. Toronto, specifically. I find that they make inaccurate lines. Yeah, yeah, that's what I would say. It's like, I used to use them all the time. That was like the ones I used in like high school and like a little into college. Um, but uh, there's just other, there's just much like nicer pens, cleaner pens you can get that I think are just more worth uh, the money, you know? Because it would be like, it's like, 250 or something to get a micron uh and that'll last you like they usually last me through an entire sketchbook which is like 160 pages um i'd say it's worth it if you're drawing a lot you know uh and you want it to be clean now it doesn't really matter if you're gonna like digitally do it later like fix it later but or you just like the quality of that if you like it to bleed a bit or like be like you know like kind of show the pressure more but uh for me i just i like it to be Nice and clean. Thanks, you. Bye. Um, or you, sorry. <laughs> uh, cool. All right, well, thanks for joining. I gotta eat dinner and, and make some calls and do a whole bunch of work. Thank you for being here. I'll see you next week. Um, feel free to join the Discord. It's in the top of my bio. And um, yeah, come to Two Minute Tuesday next week. On every Tuesday, I do a show with my friend Nikki on Instagram. Uh, we, and we just draw random stuff, your suggestions, kind of like this, but different, uh, cause we have a two minute time limit and, uh, and then we like get some AI to, to show us uh, what the thing is <laughs> through for the outro. Yeah. Uh, you know, sometimes that's all you catch. Um, yeah, but thank you. Thank you guys so much for being here. I love you. Make something if that is what you want to do and otherwise do whatever. Who cares? Uh, great. Bye. I love you. Oh, check out my shop. You can buy like stickers and stuff. <laughs>